Hi everyone, I am going to tell you how to stop navigate away from the Google Chrome uh, when uh, during examinations. Okay, uh, if you are using uh, Chromebooks, you can use this feature Google Form offers this feature, but uh, unfortunately, it only for the uh, Chromebooks. So, if you are going to uh, your Google Form and then uh, go to the settings then you can use the turn on lock mode uh, this is the only for the Google uh, Chromebooks uh, but we can apply this uh, method for the Windows computers now I am going to tell you uh, how to uh, lock the uh, form during the examination using Windows PC Okay, uh, this method can be applied for the computer labs, not only for the uh, personal computer. Okay, uh, so you can use the, there, there, there is a method, I think sometimes you may uh, know about that, Firefox uh, kiosk mode. Uh, if you are activate this Firefox uh, kiosk mode, the uh, you can see the characteristics of uh, kiosk mod uh, it is uh, very good for the examination purpose uh, students can cannot open uh, new browsers new tabs uh, there is a list of features runs in full screen mode uh, all menus uh, menu bars toolbars are not visible uh, these are the features you can uh, find the more information about uh, Google uh, kiosk uh, sorry uh, Firefox kiosk mode okay now I am tell, tell you how to activate the uh, Firefox kiosk mode on your PC okay uh, this is the normal view Firefox normal view uh, I have computer labs so I installs uh, every computer on Firefox uh, when some students using the Firefox normal view, uh, normal view, uh, yeah, uh, he can uh, uh, his windows is like this. There are tabs. You can, he can uh, open the new tabs, uh, new browsers. They can find the answer for the using Google. He can do anything. Uh, if I provide the uh, links using the uh, Firefox normally, but if I uh, provide the uh, exam link using Firefox uh, kiosk mod uh, uh, Firefox kiosk mod uh, Students can, can't do anything. So he can see the just only uh, web browser and questions papers he can't uh, he cannot open the uh, tabs so uh, extra browser uh, and any other applications uh, this is uh, also there are a list of the uh, features of uh, kiosk mode uh, full screen modes uh, we can allowable full screen mode right click doesn't work uh, all those bar title bar bookmark navigations menu not working okay so now I am going to tell you how to activate uh, this feature on uh, your Windows PC. Okay, there are two methods. Uh, we can uh, use the uh, run command box to available uh, uh, activate the uh, uh, Firefox uh, kiosk mod. Okay, so I have. Uh, 15 computers in my computer lab first of all I install the Firefox on every computer so if you use the uh, this method in your computer apps you should uh, install the Firefox in every computer uh, no need to any uh, extra add-on so other uh, software for the enable kiosk mode uh, it is a uh, uh, only you need the Firefox uh, installation on your computer okay uh, you can uh, so uh, first of all I would like to uh, 
demonstrate how to uh, open QoS mod using uh, run box. How to open QoS mod using run box. Uh, then I will uh, describe how to open QoS mod using shortcut method. Shortcut creating after creating shortcut on desktop. Uh, you can open QoS mod for the examinations. So uh, it is a, a second method uh, creating a shortcut on uh, desktop and uh, open for the examination is the very successful. So, but I uh, described two methods. First of all, I described how to uh, open uh, Firefox QoS mod using run dialog box. First methods, I am going to run uh, this query and uh, open the online paper using a uh, Firefox QoS mod. So first of all, I uh, press Windows key plus R, then I can obtain the run dialog box. Then uh, I type Firefox and dash a kiosk, then uh, I put a space and I type the uh, URL of my uh, online papers. You can apply your own URL for the your uh, online paper here. Uh, this is the com uh, command Firefox uh, dash kiosk. Then uh, you can uh, apply your own URL like this. Okay. So now I am going to run this command. Uh, remember, uh, before run this command, you should uh, close the all opening uh, or uh, Firefox uh, windows. I have no any opening Firefox uh, window. Okay. Okay. Uh, it's going to load. Now uh, your students can see uh, your uh, Google form like this. Uh, no uh, address bar, no back or uh, forward buttons, no uh, other tabs. Uh, he can uh, only uh, uh, answer this question paper. So uh, he can uh, use this uh, uh, method to uh, keep his con concentrations. Okay, so uh, this is the how to uh, this is the look how uh, we open uh, your Google papers using uh, Firefox QoS mod. Okay, uh, uh, at the end of the uh, submissions, you can use the Alt up and F4 button for the close the this uh, QoS mod uh, window. Alt up plus and uh, F4 button. Okay. So you can see the shortcut here across the window. There is a back navigate to back. You can use this shortcut Alt plus uh, back arrow Alt plus uh, forward arrow for the forward. Uh, if you want to close the window, you can use the Alt plus F4. Okay. Uh, now I am going to tell you uh, how to uh, practically apply this method inside the uh, uh, computer labs okay so I my computer lab uh, have uh, 15 computers I apply this method for the 15 computers then student come to a computer lab and uh, <coughs> uh, open the uh, kiosk mode and doing the exam very well okay so now I am going to tell you how to create a, a shortcut on your desktop computer uh, or laptop or any other lab computer uh, how to uh, create create a shortcut to open uh, this kiosk mode and papers okay uh, first of all uh, you should create a uh, shortcut for the desktop so now I am going to create shortcut uh, to uh, uh, Firefox Mozilla. I am uh, searching Mozilla Firefox. Okay, uh, this is the Firefox exe. Then I create a pro shortcut send to desktop. Okay, okay. Uh, if I uh, click on this shortcut, it will open the Firefox without any 
Chaos mode or any uh, uh, paper. So now I am convert this uh, shortcut to uh, Chaos mode and uh, with the paper link. Okay. So so uh, I rename this one. So exam one and you can uh, rename any name you want so then click on properties okay this is the properties uh, you can uh, see the targets this is the targets so <coughs> if you uh, create a shortcut you can add some text uh, end of the this uh, firefox exe so then end of the Firefox exe, uh, you should uh, apply uh, uh, dash kiosk and then your uh, paper URL. So now I am going to add these things. Okay, copy uh, Firefox kiosk. Okay, uh, this is your paper URL, my paper URL. So now I am going to add. Remember that you should, you should, you must put a space, put a space end of the this inverted comma put one space okay uh, be careful uh, don't uh, don't remember uh, don't forget to put a space after end of this uh, ESC okay then apply then okay okay I create a link to open papers with uh, five of uh, kiosk what so now i click on that okay uh, now you can see the paper without address bar forwards back but so other tabs uh, just only a paper student can work okay up the uh, end uh, submissions you can use the older key plus f4 close the uh, kiosk mode okay thank you very much if you have any problems you can uh, comment below uh, if you like, uh, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks.